You know I don't mind grilling for everybody. Besides, you know, I heard Tim switch to propane. Yeah. Just when you think you know a guy. Who made this potato salad? Who? Hey, Karen. We didn't need the raisins. Well, the Wilsons are supposed to bring dessert, but I don't really trust her not to try to sneak in a Walmart cookie platter. So I made a batch of brownies. And banana pudding. And popsicles for the kids. Hey, how y'all like your steaks cooked? You want medium? I got gotcha. you. Medium rare, not a problem. Yeet. Well done. No, how about I just give you a rock to chew on? So whose idea was it for us to eat outside? You know, real taste is just as good in the house. Whoa, 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 son. Mm -mm, that ain't how you pack a cooler, okay? It's ice, drinks, ice, drinks, ice. All right? I mean, what are they even teaching y'all in science class anymore? All right, we've got chips, succotash, watermelon, deviled eggs to go with hamburgers, hot dogs, ribs, cornbread, and dessert. I don't think that's enough food. Hey, let me tell you, I'm about this close to get me one of them Komodo Joe smokers. Yeah, I've already refinanced the house, sold a kidney. So I'm, a, I'm about a thousand dollars away. Derek wants an impossible burger? What even is that? A veggie burger? Oh, yeah, tell him it'll be impossible to get that at my house. Hey, whoa, whoa, you better put down that ketchup. I didn't marinate that chicken for 12 hours to put two coats of rub on it so you could smother it in red sugar paste. Yeah, Danny and Lisa are bringing little Anna Catherine. She's adorable, but she can really plow through some watermelon. It's not adorable when one child eats enough watermelon for 20 people, so I brought it back up. Oh, what's the matter? You dropped your hot dog. Here, let me just put it back on the grill. That'll kill all the germs. Now, I'll keep the cornhole boards away from the dessert table now. I don't want actual mud in that Mississippi mud pie Aunt Eileen made. That is my great-grandmother's recipe. Oh, listen. Everybody's grilling corn now. That's not impressive. You know what I did? I smoked a cake. Two-tier chocolate cake. 190 degrees for three and a half hours. If it don't move, I can smoke it. Let me pace myself, because I got three more backyards to hit today and a limited supply of small talk. <laughs> you think this is impressive? You should have seen my spread on the 4th of July. I had five different kinds of meats, all of them wrapped in bacon. You had to take five Lipitor just to come near this grill. Did you invite Joe? <laughs> oh no, I would just love to be down in a plate of beans in front of my ex-boyfriend. <laughs> really let him know what he been missing. Oh, you think I do that just for fun? Nah, this is how we dads communicate with each other. That's actually Morse code. Yeah, this guy gets it. Brought to you by Renaissance Bank, the bank that understands you. Learn more at renaissancebank.com.